name is Dustin Krajewski, captain with the San Bernardino County Fire Department. Today we're doing live fire training that encompasses several of our truck skills that we teach throughout our basic fire tower. Search, forcible entry, and ventilation. We applied live fire to all those activities. In two-person teams, they were practicing vent inter-isolate search under live fire conditions. In that operation, one, one team member throws the ladder to uh, break and access the, the compartment where we have a known rescue. From there, he enters that room and he isolates that room from the flow path of the fire by shutting the interior door, which will reduce the, the flow path uh, to that room. So it'll cut off smoke and the possibility for fire to travel to that room and out that window. Uh, from there, a second team member comes up the ladder and begins to utilize a tick to help assist in searching for victims. Once a victim is located after isolating the fire, they then remove the victim from that window uh, where the second person up the ladder is the one who's going to receive the victim and bring that unconscious victim down the ladder. The far side team that was cutting on the roof was practicing vertical ventilation with live fire, so they were cutting holes to remove uh, toxic uh, smoke, heat, and gases from the environment to make the conditions more tenable for both victims and the fire attack crews that are pushing in to extinguish the fire. On the fire container, we had uh, we were cutting roll-up doors, simulating a garage fire or it could have been any type of warehouse fire where we have fire behind a roll-up door uh, where that is our best access point to get water on the fire. So they were cutting small triangular holes uh, large enough to get our nozzles inside where we can then apply water, steam that fire out, and once we have knockdown and conversion, we can cut the rest of that door open to make entry and completely extinguish the fire.